the most common question I get asked by far is about nutrition. Like what do I eat? What do I not eat? When do I eat? And so in this video, for the first time ever, I plan on sharing with you what a typical average day of eating looks like. And more importantly, the reason why I eat the way I do and three simple concepts for you to focus on to stay fit, stay lean and shredded all year round. So if you're watching this video, you probably already know that protein is a pretty big deal in the fitness world. But the first concept is simple. Protein is the priority. Protein is my biggest priority and I try to get it in as early as often, aiming for around 200 grams every single day. Ironically enough, most people think supplements are the first place to start with nutrition. Don't get me wrong, supplements aren't bad, they just shouldn't be the main thing. They should supplement an already balanced and protein-focused diet. Now, having said that, I do believe there are a few essential supplements that everybody should be taking. Like right now, I'm making this tasty collagen and whey protein milkshake from Transparent Labs. I think everyone should be on creatine, whether it's pill form or powder. To me, there's no downside of creatine. I stay around 2.5 to 5 milligrams daily and have been on a pretty consistent creatine supplement for the better part of two years. Make sure you're hydrating, but there's no real downside. In fact, there's tons of physical benefits, obviously, muscle uh, size and recovery, but also cognitive benefits as well. And if you're like me and you forget stuff, and you need a little bit extra cognitive push, it's a great freaking supplement. <laughs> All right, so today is gonna be a bit busy during the lunchtime midday period. Got some stuff going on. So instead of eating lunch with you, I'm going to show you what's in my lunchbox. And yes, I still make myself lunch and I stick it in a lunchbox, so. Before we get into my actual lunch, I wanted to share with you concept number two, and that is eating God-made foods. I put 80-20 because I think anything extreme is hard to sustain long-term. And so I, I love a lifestyle that's flexible. I like to enjoy food. I like to go to restaurants. And so for me, it's 80-20 for sure. So 80% of the time, I focus on real single ingredient foods on the outskirts of the grocery aisle, the meats, the cheeses, the fruits and the veggies. And then of course, I make room every single day for sweets and some other snacks, which you'll see later in the video. So back to the actual details of my lunch today. It's very simple. Uh, there's Greek yogurt, there's mush oats, there's a turkey sandwich with American cheese and mayo and mustard, and then there's an apple banana. And of course, my peanut butter honey cinnamon toast. One more thing, maybe I'll snack on some, some uh, trail mix, like a protein uh, focused snack, like nuts, almonds, cashews, maybe some dried fruit in there. And that's typically uh, a go-to of mine to hold me over until dinner time. Thank you for our family. Thank you for our health. And in Jesus' name. Amen. Yes, I'm a big believer in blessing the food as a family and creating that culture of gratitude for our baby girl and for us. As you can see, we are eating air fried chicken breast made by my beautiful wife, and then some fire sweet potatoes and green beans. <laughs> The last and final concept that I think is useful to you and your fitness journey is this idea of it's all about energy balance. For example, if I wanted to lose, let's say 10 pounds of body fat, I wouldn't just do more cardio and I wouldn't just go on some crazy extreme diet. What I would do is focus on concepts one and two. I would probably cut out unnecessary uh, liquid calories, things like sodas and energy drinks and maybe alcohol. 
and then just focus on my daily movements. So if I'm walking 6,000 steps a day, I would easily up that to 8,000, maybe 10,000. And then of course, always showing up and lifting weights four times a week. And the last thing I'll say is this, consistency is everything. So I don't try to do any extreme diets or any extreme training. I just try to be consistent as possible because I know results compound over time. But I could ramble forever. So if you have a specific question about nutrition or my nutrition, leave a comment and I'll answer below. So there you have it. I'm gonna show you some rapid fire treats that I eat on a daily basis. But I think the big takeaway from this video is this is what a day in the life of my eating looks like. It's balanced, there's some sweets in there, there's some fake foods, you know, Oreos of course. But no matter what, I'm a big believer in balance and practicing concepts one through three consistently. So I hope this video was helpful. Leave a comment below if you have any questions. And until next time, guys, thanks for watching. Peace.